Welcome to my early Christmas 2019. It's December 23rd and I'm leaving for Arizona. Oh no, it's December 22nd. I'm leaving for Arizona in two days on the 24th to spend the actual Christmas with Gabe. That's why we're celebrating early. I've been home from my travels in India since September and I'm just really enjoying being here in Vancouver. I got a cool funky hat from Grandma and Grandpa. I got here on the 19th and last night I went clubbing with my friends at Yale. I am delighted to be here with Grandma and Grandpa and our three kids. Yesterday we all went to Deep Cove except for Connor who flew in yesterday and we had an enjoyable day with the seagulls. Uh, we are delighted to be here in uh, Vancouver for Christmas with our lovely family and grandchildren and it's finally stopped raining and today we are going to lunch at the um, Sylvia Hotel where my mother lived the last six or seven years of her life so that will be very nice. It's a pleasure for me to be here after a five-year absence. Look at the camera. One, one of them caused Look at the camera. You can't see one it. of them caused by Marion tripping over a snowflake but <laughs> we made it this year and we'll be here from the 8th of 18th of December to the 27th, enjoying all of the grandchildren and their parents. Woohoo! Woohoo! Um, our father forgot his Connor. least favorite child. <laughs> yeah, I'm over here. <laughs> I'm Connor in case you forgot. Okay, we're not gonna I came home yesterday, the 21st, went for drinks with my friends, went to a concert yesterday. What I want to read next. Oh. Rock. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Allie, it's just. We're, we're already underneath. Allie, you will take that for Gabe. Oh, thank you guys. That's so sweet. Make it nice here. Happy holidays. holidays. Where's Noel? <laughs> this is the Sylvia Hotel, and I live approximately two blocks from here. Nice to have the whole family together. It's lovely to be here with all our beautiful grandchildren and friends. Hello, we got the sun for us finally after a couple of days of rain, and it's lovely to have all the family here. I'm hoping Grandpa doesn't pour cranberry juice on his pancakes again. <laughs> <laughs> it's wonderful to spend the first Christmas brunch with the Dunn family. Uh, it's a beautiful day, there's snow on the mountains, sun in the sky, and wonderful to have the family here. I'm glad to be done exams and relaxing with the family. Looking forward to the seawall walk after brunch. Don't forget Granny. Suzanne, the upper left. I forgot what it was that I was going to say. And I'm the official photographer. I just want to say that Marion is very, very pretty. How's the food? Great. What'd you get? What'd you get? Eggs Benedict. What'd you get? Uh, smoked salmon eggs Benedict. That's why I said it's better for the performance. Welcome to Vancouver. Okay, here we are at the Sylvia Hotel. Everyone's having fun. The best part of the evening was the pictures. Everyone's really enjoying the pictures. And on free, Merry Christmas. Free. Merry Christmas. And cut. We're being held captive. How's the walk so far? Terrific. Beautiful. How's the walk? Woo! Awesome. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. This is the official 2019 Christmas, December 25th, 10.30 a.m. opening. I'm excited to open my stocking and it'll be a good day. Allie is in Arizona with Gabe, but we already did a mini Christmas with her. And this is the real one. This is the Christmas carnage. We finished opening our stockings and now we're going to have breakfast and phone all the other people we have to phone today. Thanks for all the good gifts. Thank you. We just FaceTimed Marilee, Margot, and Bruce in Monaco, and they haven't opened their presents yet, but they're about to do it. Monaco's in Europe. They're in the United States. <laughs> Where are they? California. Malibu. Malibu. <laughs> Connor? We talked to Auntie Susie and Grandma and Grandpa, Melissa, and they are just about to open their presents. They haven't started yet. Everyone's having a late day. And we got a Merry Christmas from Allie. Jim and I were still sleeping. It was about 9.30. She's in Arizona. And so we had a nice FaceTime with her. 
here's all our Christmas stuff. We did very well this year. We had a great Christmas. And we still have to phone Donald and Janice and Andrew and Anthony in Ottawa. Merry Christmas! Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas! Tonight I'm cooking. Woo! Tonight I cook the turkey. Tonight I eat the turkey. <laughs> I am honored to spend time with the Dunn family for Christmas. I'm a senior supervisor. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I'm here with Nicholas Wooster, Suzanne, Alyssa, and the Dunn's, everybody. It's so great to be together. Okay, back to work! I didn't I talk. I didn't talk. forgot Mom and Connor. Nick too. Yeah. I am just here being waited on hand and foot, and it's a lovely change. What are they doing I'm for just the sous foot? chef. You're what? The sous chef. And the sommelier. <laughs> you mean yeah. you're cooking for your mother, Sue? Connor. This is the second time you forgot me. I'm your son, Connor. Nice job. <laughs> nice job, nice to meet you. Once you're all here. Actually, hey, hey. thanks to the cooks. No paparazzi. Everybody, cooks. thank you to Dude. the cooks. Wonderful Dude. meal. Thank you. Yay! This food, bless this family. Yeah. Bless how lucky we all are to be here tonight. Non-denominational. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited for our first family holiday to Tofino. It's been three years, so it's going to be fun. It'll be my third time in Tofino and Connor and Austin's first. We're at a pit stop about an hour away from Tofino and Gabe and I went cliff jumping last time just down there. Pick up at the shed. And I have a tuna poke bowl, it's so good. You got a burger. I have a pacha mama bowl. Woo! That was awesome. We're playing spike ball right now.
Filipino and we're surfing. <laughs> Um, we're having a great day here at Tofino with the fam. Everybody did really well, exceeded my expectations, especially mom. She was really struggling at first. I was scared. Great. I was scared of the waves at first and then I um, I overcame my fear. Connor was dropping in on some waves. Yeah. I got muscle spasms in my legs, so I got hit by waves. This is where we rented all our surf gear. We're just returning it right now and then getting some brunch. There's our boards. Goodbye boards. So what's it? Abracadabra. And my burger looks great. We're just having a quick look at Long Beach. Looks like some good waves out there. We're at Pacific Coast Bull Cult Cowboys. Zoe's Bakery, which is right across the street from Allie and Gabriel's apartment. This is the place that I bought. And I was with <laughs> it's our new apartment. It's on, the, it. it's on the far right side. We just went to Zoe's, which is around the corner. It's going to be our new favorite bakery. Connor is home after three years in the United States Hi. of America. Hi. We're not Hi. supposed to hug you. Hi, honey. Hi. COVID-19 handshakes. Hi. I'm so happy you're here. Yeah. Where's Allie? Over there! Woo! Welcome. Thanks. You look great, honey. The water is super easy. It's not in there. It's really nice and fast. Yo! What's up? What's up? up? <laughs> Give you a hug, but no love. Pop her and bring it back? Sure, I'm not going to need it. How much are you unloading? Not that much. Easy. What's in there? All the clothes I'm not wearing. Okay. So what are you excited to do once you're out of your two weeks of quarantine? See my friends, hang out with you guys, catch up with people. Tonight Matt and Margaret are coming over for a barbecue with Gabe and I. We have breaking news. One of the engineers at NGO has a contact in Vancouver for a geotechnical instrumentation company and they're looking for people in Vancouver that can help them out with some other projects they have here because their employees can't come up because of COVID. So their NGO is working with that company to have an on-call contract with me to help them do some instrumentation work, setting up instruments and analyzing data on the Patello Bridge rehab or reconstruction, the Fraser River rail bridge rehab or reconstruction, not sure which one, and one of the rail line expansions. So they're working on a three month contract for me to help them out with that still working for NGO and then after that they want to offer me a full-time job but I don't think I'm going to take that I'll probably Good still news. keep working for NGO. Woohoo everyone. Woo! Yeah.